This demo is going to show how Click Application can be used for task orchestration and task chaining. So in this demo, we will have a Click Application Automation orchestrating a series of tasks. Uh, so there's going to be two tasks in Talent Cloud that are going to be run at the same time. And if an error occurs, Click Application Automation will send a message to ServiceNow creating an incident uh, so that a user can take action on this. If everything runs fine, we run a subsequent task. So this is our task chaining. And if everything is well in this task as well, we will send a message to Microsoft Teams so that the user knows that the task was run successfully. This automation contains two tasks that are being executed in parallel, here with the execute task block. We then wait for these two tasks to complete. Those tasks are comma separated over here in the execution IDs. We then get the task status for both of these tasks. And we then check with the condition block on whether these were successful. If they were not successful, we create an incident on ServiceNow and the, with a description explaining what went wrong, or rather just the task status. If we are successful, then we proceed with a third task that is dependent on the other two tasks. Before that, we once again wait for these tasks to complete. We get a task status to be able to track if it was successful or not. If it was successful, we send out an email to the user, and if not, we create an incident in ServiceNow. Now we are going to start running our automation. So we click here on the Run button. And this should trigger our two tasks in Talent. So we go to the Talent Management Console, and we should see those two tasks popping up in a minute. So two tasks are running. Now in our Automations Overview, we can see that this task has run. So we can see the two tasks, we can see that it waited for the task to complete, getting the task status, but it was not successful. Um, the, the first one did succeed, however the second one had a deployment fail. So we created an incident in ServiceNow. We should be able to see this incident in ServiceNow by navigating here, reloading this page and checking the latest created incident. An incident was locked to ServiceNow and our incident is right here. So when we click on it, we can see that our task was not successful and it gave us an error message about why it was not successful. After some fixing of our pipelines, we can now rerun our pipeline and hopefully this is successful. So we click Run Automation. All of the tasks ran successfully, so we should now have an email uh, containing the status report of our task. Our task ran successful and we got an email to confirm that it was successful. What we have seen in this demo is how click application automation can be used to orchestrate tasks. We can run tasks in parallel and wait for completion. We can also send messages to different platforms on completion or error states. So for example, our ServiceNow connector, we can easily in, uh, change for a JIRA connector and create an issue. By going to our JIRA connector, create issue instead of ServiceNow. Or instead of sending an email out of completion, we can make use of our Teams connector and send a message on Microsoft Teams. That concludes this demo.